hello everyone welcome back to my channel so in today's video guys i'm going to show you how to make your baby food at home so in today's video the baby food i'm going to be making i'm going to make pear puree for my baby my baby is just five months old and i'm going to make this puree for her so i have about four pear in here i'm not going to use all of them i'm not I'm just going to use three of them and I have all these small small containers where I keep my baby food after making it and I also have my pot everything has already been washed and clean I use this pot to make just my baby food I don't use it for something else and here is my blender the one I'm going to use to blend my pear puree so without wasting much of your time I'm just going to go ahead and wash my pear then I will start peeling them and now that my pear is has been washed and I'm just going to start cutting it and peel it then now. We are going to peel everything one after the other. Then after peeling it, just cut it into tiny, tiny sizes. Cut them just like this, just the way I'm doing it now. After cutting it, you just add it into your pot. Do the same thing to the rest of your pear. So now I'm just going to add it into my pot. Then I will continue peeling the rest of my pear. Like I said earlier, my pot has already been washed. And I'm still going to rest it now before adding my pear into it. And here is after peeling my pear and cut it there you can see how it's looking I'm just going to add in some water I'm still going to add a bit more that's enough so now I'm just going to cover it and put it in my gas cooker just allow it to boil up for about one to two minutes just allow it to boil up then you remove it from the cooker and now it's time for you to remove your pear from the cooker and my cooker has already been off now it just i'll just give it time to cool down before i start blending it And now that my pear has cooled down a bit, it's not 
also cold but it has cooled down for about six to seven minutes or so so now i'm just going to continue i'm just going to start blending it i'll just add everything into my blender if you don't want your baby puree to be watery you can uh, you can separate the water from the pear before you blend it but like i said earlier my baby is just five months old so i don't want it to be thick that's the reason why i normally add all the water so that is how i used to do it before i give my baby and she like it so much so now that my puree is well blended now my puree is well blended now and it's very smooth so i'm just going to off my blender then remove my puree from the blender so like just the container the small small containers i showed earlier i'm just going to put them inside here so here is after pouring my pure my pure puree inside the container and this is the one my baby is going to eat now so guys if you like this video please give it a thumbs up comment and share and if you haven't subscribed please don't forget to subscribe i will see you all in my next video see you all soon guys bye